This large valley between Enumboso in the eastern region and Pekin in the Volta region, from a distance, looks like a forest cover. But in reality, it is host to a large tract of cannabis farms. The farmers build temporary structures in these hard-to-reach areas where they rear animals and grow a few crops for survival. However, they commit much more energy into the cultivation of these leaves worth more than carrots and cabbages. With 60 police officers slashing down these plants for hours, they were able to cover just 17 farms with several hundreds more left to be covered. Superintendent David Selom Hukwati is the director of Police Drug Law Enforcement Unit of the Criminal Investigations Department of the Ghana Police Service. How many do you intend to um, my, my, my goodness, uh, so far, I think uh, this is the, the 17th farm since morning. And then uh, um, looking at the enclave, I can say we have over, over 100 acres, hundreds of acres. Mm -hmm. Because that mountain that you see, that mountain that we see, uh, some of our men already, our intel guys have gone there. So, I mean, we have to do all that and go to all other places. Uh, so far, I would say we destroyed about uh, 20%. And even that, we have to uh, deploy drones. The police managed to arrest two persons on one of the farms to aid in their investigations. The cultivation, exportation, importation, and the use of cannabis without lawful authority or without a license in Ghana are prohibited. The new law, the Narcotic Control Commission Bill, empowers the Minister for Interior to grant licenses for the cultivation of cannabis of not more than 0.3% THC, the main psychoactive compound in cannabis that gives the users a high sensation for industrial and medicinal purposes. The law also makes the country's Narcotic Control Board, NACOB, a commission with enhanced powers to oversee the industrial use of some narcotic substances. But the commission will still have the mandate to control and eliminate the trafficking of prohibited narcotic drugs to ensure public safety. Superintendent Hupoti explains what it will take to legally deal in cannabis in Ghana. I, I just want to send a word of advice to everybody or everybody interested in the cultivation of uh, cannabis that they should ask suspicions when the things are put in place properly they can apply to the Ministry of uh, Interior. And then the, all other due diligence will, will be done, and then uh, they will be permitted. Uh -huh. So their activity is properly uh, regularized. Instead of uh, you know, always being at the wrong side of the law and you know, forcing us also to enforce the law to the letter. So this is what I can give them. So, But the law still uh, disallow the use uh, of uh, cannabis uh, for uh, recreational purpose, abuse and things like that. So that is different from uh, the authorization that uh, may be given if you apply for, for a permit or license. The team of police personnel had to leave the forest early enough before darkness fell as angry residents of Enumbosu had started dumping obstacles on the roads leading to the cannabis farms.